Hey there guys, how are you? It's four o'clock in the morning, but that doesn't matter because I have an energy drink right here. And with all that said, I promised you I'd give you a brand new tour of the Foot Cave, which is now in an office building, and I'll explain a little bit later, but let's just go, let's go. All right, this is it. Don't get scared now. Welcome to the brand new Flick Cave. This is where the magic happens. This is where I talk to you guys. And every once in a while, it gets a little bit weird, a little bit crazy, a little bit magical, and a little bit mystical. And I got a toy shark right there. It doesn't matter. That's what we're doing. And right here, uh, this is the new, well, this is where I call this my command center. And I'm going to be doing weekly podcasts over on my John Flixer channel, my second channel. So I got the long arms there. It makes me feel like Howard Stern. Oh, yeah. Feels good. This is where I edit my videos. This is where I sit for very long hours, chewing on cinnamon candy and eating Sour Patch Kids. All right, so first things first, whenever I come to make a new video that you guys watch, I light up my set and that's right, I'm all about ambiance. It's like a Joel Schumacher Batman movie. I like everything to be glowing with different colors and lights and LEDs. So the first thing I do is I turn them all on. There's that, there's that one, that one. And we got all these down here. Yeah, I don't have to pay the electricity bill here. Uh, and then those. Is that necessary? No, but it makes me feel safe and secure, and I like it. I just like the way it glows. It really, it just, it doesn't feel magical. It just feels good. Ever since I was a younger kid, this is what I always wanted. All right, so now I want to show you guys my stuff in my background. First things first, King Kong, man. This is the badass. And the thing I've always liked about this is you have this big beast, and he's holding a little woman in his hands. He's chained up but he still breaks free to hold a woman in his hands. I think that says something. And then over here, I have my Ant-Man helmet, my cool bobblehead endoskeleton, T-800, and my DeLorean from Back to the Future Part Two. It's even got Mr. Fusion back there. 1.21 gigawatts! You've been poisoned with a psychotropic hallucinogen. Don't look at me. Well, that's Batman, everyone. And by the way, the reason my Stormtrooper has his hands up is because he's surrendering. That's right. Uh, but another prized possession right here, by the way, my mom got me that for Christmas, she got me that for Christmas, and she got me that for Christmas. Thanks, Mom. You're the best. Uh, but the other prized possession is my T-800 endoskeleton right here. It also has a few Blu-rays in the bottom of it. I love this thing. I want to push the button right now so we can all hear how annoying it just is. Shut the fuck up! It looks better than it sounds. That's my miniature Deadpool who sits on the ledge and protects me from all forces of evil. That's my awesome little Freddy figure right there. I love Freddy. Even though he has a dark past and wears a Christmas sweater, I still respect the guy as a character. And then I have my cool Enterprise right here. This was a gift uh, from my uh, good pal, Crazy Jason. I love it. And then I have the Hulk. That is a symbol of power, energy, and split personalities. I confide in this figure. And this, this right here, this is a custom made. Now the original of this that you buy at Toys R Us, it looks like shit. It's plain, it's boring. My good pal, cosplay Chris, he custom made it, he painted it, he added LEDs to it, sent it to me. I love the Hulkbuster suit. It's just pure badass. This is everything I ever wanted. I, I actually want a Hulkbuster suit. Uh, and down here I got Darth Vader. I got a lightsaber, because you never know. Now I've said this once and I'll say it again. You don't need an expensive security system. You don't need a guard dog. If you have one of these in your household, no one's gonna fuck with you, I promise. Hey there guys, how are you? So this is typically how I start every video off and this is what you see, me and everything in the background, but there's much more. Uh, for instance, you guys are on a tripod right now. Did you know that? I bet you didn't. And also, what I talk into, my Rode video mic right here. Now, what I do is I actually put my Rode video mic on a separate tripod. That way I can have a lower angle, I can put it a little bit closer to me, and it takes away the echo. I used to put it on top of the camera and I always picked up an echo or reverb in the room, and I found that this method works best. Uh, but yeah, if you guys want more info on all my equipment and everything I'm using, I'll put all the links down below, it goes to Amazon, so you guys can get all the specs and details and get a closer look for yourselves. But you know what, this is essentially, that's everything. This is where I make videos. And when I sit here, it's, it's just almost like a shot of adrenaline. Like, 
everything around me motivates me. You got the lights. It's just, it, I really enjoy it. And with all that said, I wanted to give you guys some personal insight to what's going on in my life and pretty much what I plan on doing in the future. My name is Morgan Freeman. That mic's not even on, but every time I see a microphone, that's what I must do. Uh, but yeah, I wanted to give you guys some quick updates about my life, my future plans, what I want to do. This is why I'm in an office space and no longer working out of my home. What I did is I'm crazy, love makes you do wild and stupid things, but you know what? You only live once and you got to go for it. So I have a lady friend, my girlfriend, and what I did is I packed up, I moved 600 miles from Fort Wayne, Indiana to Greenville, South Carolina, and we live together now. And where we live, there's not quite enough space to do what I need to do, so I rented out an office space, and there's multiple reasons. It's not only the space, it's also, it makes me more productive. It's like, if you have a place, you go to work, you can come here 24 hours a day. I have a secretary that works up at the front, I don't think she likes me, but it's okay. I love Deb. I love you, Deb! Woo! Okay, uh, that actually wasn't even a joke. I really do have a receptionist that works at the front. Her name is Deb. She doesn't just work for me. She works for the building, but I claim that she's mine. Uh, but yeah, Toy Shark. Uh, but a few other things I wanted to mention to you guys. I want to start making more videos than I ever have. I know in the past I have slacked. I sound like a, a politician right now. I've made mistakes, but I've changed. This is for us. This is for America. Uh, but I do want to make more videos, and if you guys have been watching lately, and especially my second channel, John Flickster, you guys have seen more videos. And that's thanks to this. This is where I come, this is where I focus, and it's just it's a mental thing, and when I come in here, I can feel the energy, I start pulsating. It's almost like we're in a rave, together, and there's glow sticks, except there's LED lights, there's Batman, and a Rockstar energy drink. But essentially, in the future, I want to make as many videos as I possibly can because that's what I like to do. That's what keeps me going. That's my goal. And I'm glad that a lot of you guys have stuck with me for so long. And I hope if you're new, well, just understand me. I'm weird. Just give me a few minutes of your time. And by the end of the video, we're going to have a connection. Now, earlier on in the video, I mentioned these mics right here. And the reason I have these is I want to start doing a weekly podcast over on my second channel. And I just love to talk movies. It's going to be once a week, about an hour long, where me and my good pal, Crazy Jason, we just talk movies, we talk shit. It's good. It's weird. It's dark. It's creepy at times. But overall, it's a really good time. So look out for that over on the second channel, John Flickster. Uh, but yeah, just, something, just look at this mic right here. Just look at it. You can hold it. It comes to you. You can lean back in your chair. And uh, you can just, this is what I want to do. So, do you guys remember how awesome Corey Feldman was back in 1987? That was just the pinnacle of life. Hey, you guys! Look out for that. One hour long. That kind of shit. <sighs> so, I think that pretty much covers everything. I hope you guys, well, know a little bit more about me and the, the new location of the Flick Cave. I don't know why I'm holding this right now, but it does make me feel better about who I am and what I'm doing. Uh, anyway, guys, here's my question. Do let me know down below in the comments section. What do you guys want to see in the future? Are there, are there any video series that you want to see, maybe top tens. Give me what you guys want to see down below in the comment section because I do read that shit. That's why I'm not a Jedi, but I'm going to put that down now. Uh, but anyway, guys, the reason I ask is because I do want to make the kind of videos that you want to see and the kind of videos that I want to make. So yeah, once again, leave everything that you guys want to see down below or just tell me how you're feeling, what's going on in your lives. As usual, guys, thanks for watching. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe. And that way, I can see you next time.